Next is the learning objective. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to 1. Define the safety procedures during drilling process. 2. Define the drilling process. 3. Identify the types of drill bits. 4. Identify the nomenclature for the drilling machine. 5. Explain the process of operating the drilling process. And last, calculate the RPM for the drilling process. Let's move on with the next. What is the purpose of drilling operation? Drilling is an operation of making a circular hole by removing a volume of metal from the chalk by cutting tool called a drill. A drill is a rotary end cutting tool with one or more cutting nibs and usually one or more fluids for the passage of chips and the admission of cutting fluid. Okay, let's start with the drill bit nomenclature. First, we have the fluid, the heel, the land, the body clearance, the body, and also the shank. The nomenclature for the drilling machine is as follow. First, we have the pulley, belt, motor, table clamp, column, base table, regular work table, chart, spindle, spindle clamp, and depth adjustment. Okay, now we have come to how to calculate the spindle speed for drilling. Okay, this is the formula whereby we have the N is equal to V times 1000 over pi times D and the unit is RPM whereby the V is the cutting speed in meter per minute D is the diameter of drill bit in mm and pi is 3.12 okay next we are going to do some exercise following other example of the situation what would be the spindle speed for diameter 6 mm drill bit for mild steel with the cutting speed of V is equal to 30 meter per minute? Okay, we put it the formula there, pi equals to V times 1000 divided by pi times D. Okay, then we input all the figure there. Then we get the answer. 1591.34 RPM. Don't forget about the unit, the RPM. This is the drilling machine you will operate next class. Please set aside your workpiece and drawing to a clear space on the table. Check the drawing on the position and size of the hole to be drilled. Check the condition of the drill chart and make sure it is secured properly to the spindle. Choose the correct drill bit size and check the overall condition of the drill bit. Secure the drill bit to the chart by loosening the chart and inserting the drill bit shank side first. Please ensure that the drill bit is concentric with the chuck. Adjust the speed according to the calculated RPM by referring to the machine table for the correct pulley size. Lower the tension of the pulley belt and open the top cover of the drilling machine. Reposition the pulley belt accordingly and then close the cover and tighten the pulley belt again. Check the tension of the belt and make sure the tension is correct. Clean the machine table and clamping vise. 
fasten the workpiece to the vise and adjust the height of the drilling table. Lower the chuck by turning the lever to check the position of the markings on the workpiece with the drill point. Then turn on the machine, then apply pressure until the chipping process can be seen. Then lift the drill bit up and apply coolant to the drill bit. the drilling process until complete. You may stop and add more filling when necessary.